Porter and take you to Anna Papico as they play host to East Clarendon. Turberville coming to town. East Clarendon's Kate Cook, he would start this game off early for the Wolverines. Wolverines. Passes it to the right, but it's intercepted. JK, Josh McNeil. He gives Hannah Pamplico something to scream about with a short field to play with. That will lead to William here getting the handoff, and he cuts around the right side, shrugs off a tackle, to punch it in. Hannah Pamplico up pretty quickly, six zip. Later on, though, East Clarendon's Jay Webb, he gets the handoff, and he breaks out to the left, and he gets the first down before being pushed out of bounds. And the cheerleaders, watch out, ladies. Yeah, watch out, your girls. All right, that gets progress for the Wolverines as they get this touchdown here. Number two getting the handoff and making this a tied game, 6-6. Six, six. Maybe close, Anna Papico, they, they're used to some close games though. Second quarter, Anna Papico's Jamarcus Williams gets the handoff for this big run here. 60 yards for the lead back to the house. You can dive all you want, sir. You're not catching that speedster. 14-6, Anna Papico at the half. And it's become to the final. And it was on just this. the beginning of a big night for them as HP rolls tonight, picking up their third win of the season. Big win. The struggles for the Wolverines continue as they still look for that first win, still trying to get that goose egg off of the win column. As for the Raiders, back home next week, as we just alluded to, with Johnsonville coming to town. That will be another big test for the Raiders from Hannah Pampico. Alrighty, my friends.